Hello guys, welcome to the channel and today we're going to be solving this problem here applying Lambert function. So Lambert function says that lab w of e to the a, a times e to the a equals a. So what we're going to do here, we're just going to um, work on this expression to, m to make it look something similar to this one here uh, when it comes possible, right? So Let's solve then. I'm going to send the x to the right side of the equation and then I'm going to flip the equation and divide both sides by 80 to the x and then we're going to have this one. Now because I have 80 here, I'm going to multiply both sides by 80 to the power of 80 so that I can have here in the power um, 80 to the power of 80 minus x. So then we have this one, which is, which means I'm multiplying uh, both sides of the equation by 80 to the 80, right? So now we're going to have this one. Okay, cool. From here, we're going to apply this property and this property here. And then this means that we're going to have this one here, which, which we applied here, right? This is e to the ln of this function. And then I'm going to leave this side the way it is because uh, there, there are not much stuff that can be done here. Okay, so... We're going to leave the way it is and then applying this one, we get this one here and then we have this. OK, but it's still not the same, right? Because we have ln here and we don't have ln here multiplying this, this expression. So that's why we're multiplying both sides by ln of 80 and then we have this one here. Now, this one here is equal to this one here, right? So we can apply the Lambert function in both sides of the equation. And then from here, our a is 80 minus x ln of 8. So we got this one. And then we're going to keep the, uh, the, the Lambert function for this expression here. So, and then, well, uh, I'm going to send this ln, ln of 80 dividing here, ma making some organization here. We're going to have this one here. And then from this one, we're going to have that this one we have to plug this one into the calculator, which is Wolfram Alpha. I just forgot to put the picture here of this calculation, but you have to plug this in, into Wolfram, Wolfram Alpha to find the value of this expression, which is 79 um, and point something, right? So the difference of these two terms, making some approximation, we're gonna have, um, which is, well, this is the same thing, I just, I just repeated it with three, uh, three digits here. So we're gonna have that X is approximately 0,997. Okay, so guys, that's it. That's the, that's the approximate, approximation and the solution for this problem. And now let's have some, uh, some check here. I'm gonna check first with three, three digits here and then with 10 digits here to see what we're gonna have, right? So, well, replacing the value of x in the original equation, we're going to have 80 plus 0. Uh, remember that the original equation is 80 to the x plus x equals 80, right? So now we have to, 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 to prove this, right, with this approximation. So from here, we're going to have this one, which is the same thing. I don't know why I just uh, repeated it. And then this one to the part of this, we're going to have this one and plus this one. Is it equal to 80? This will give us approximately uh, 79 times uh, 79.952, um, right? Which is approximately equals to 80. And this one here, I just repeated. I don't know why, but this is the same thing. Now let's get to with check with 10 digits here. I just put 10 digits here. Let's see what we're gonna have here. Well, what we have here, we had the first one here with three digits, we had 78 times, I mean, that 955. Five. But with 10 digits here, we have 79 times that 003, and then plus this one, uh, we're just getting close to three digits as well. So this is actually going to be 80 equals to 80. So what happened is, guys, we are not using the real value, I mean, the complete value of x, right? We're just using some approximation. The that's the reason why I did the check with three digits and 10 digits. You see that uh, the more digits you have, the closer you get to the, um, to the 80, right? So this, is the, this, this was the problem of today. 
don't forget to subscribe guys uh need your help god bless you all see you next video bye bye